Hello everyone, it's Scarlett. Today we came to OK Energy Company. This company mainly produces oxyhydrogen generators. Now let Ellen talk about this product. Hello everyone, welcome to OK Energy. I'm Ellen. OK Energy was established in 2006. We have been focused on researching, developing, and manufacturing HHO oxyhydrogen generators. We aim at producing new energy, improving energy efficiency, reducing costs and environmental impact, protecting the Earth and our homeland. Our products have been sold to over 60 countries all over the world. So, Ella, you have mentioned about HHO technology. What is it? HHO technology is water became gas, water became fire technology. HHO machine just consume water and electricity. It uh, split water into oxyhydrogen gas. So, what's the application of your oxyhydrogen generators? Oxyhydrogen generators have many applications. It was widely used for car engine carbon cleaning, polishing, sealing, welding, cutting, heating, and so on. It's so great. I can't wait to visit your factory. Okay, let's go. Okay. So, Ellen, we are in your workshop, right? Yes. So, what's this area? This area is raw material area. All of these are stainless steel materials. Raw materials, right? Yes. Okay. is our electrolytic cell production area. The cell is the main part of the HHO generators. We have uh, many skilled and experienced workers here, all worked over 10 years. 10 years, very yeah. great. All of the parts were hand welding. From this semi-finished welding product, we can see the welding joint is very smooth, and we can hardly see the soldering seam. After welding, all of the parts will be put into a high-pressure water tank. It should pass through 3 to 8 bar high-pressure test. All of these four tests will make sure the electrolysis cell is 100% no leakage and ensure it is headless. So this worker is assembling, right? Yes, this is an assembly area. There are three steps. Firstly, install the electrolysis cell, power supply unit, and the by fire system. Secondly, install the human machine interface and the PLC control system. Thirdly, do well connection and keep consistency of all of the parts. After assembling work, all of the machine will be sent to the testing area. The machine should be done reliability test, electrical test, compression test, gas leak test, and so on. After finishing these four tests in quality check, only qualified products will be sent to the warehouse for dispatching.